Thailand is home to 10% of the world's flowering plants, with more than 27,000 different species and blooms in this harsh landscape. Their names read like poetry. Water lily. Chinese rose. But as poetic and beautiful as the flowers may be, they need help to survive. Birds, along with butterflies, Bird. bees and other insects, play an important role in helping flowers to reproduce. The birds nest for food, material, shelter. In turn, they carry the pollen Helping from to one flower to another. Plants. The rainforest is full of life. Thing upon awakening, the each morning family announces its presence using their territorial hooting several kilometers away. Paul warns intruding gibbons and other animals to stay out of their territory. Although gibbons are the smallest of the ape species, member of the primate chimpanzee, cousin to the rabbit and, and ourselves, they are kings and queens of the forest canopy. Omnivorous, eating a variety of foods. They forage Ex during the day, variety of fruits, eating fig leaves and flowers. But the white-handed gibbon is particularly fruitless. Forest is a good indication of, of a plentiful supply of fruiting trees. In a forest glade, another mammal would look there. Are curious and attentive. Given. Not too cautious. To be on the Furred safe side, female, the brown comfort, comfort with her chosen black furred male. The black bear will climb to rest, the enemies eat or lure, but is much too slow for the gibbons. The masters of the canopy. Whether walking on their feet on the tops of the branches or swinging from one branch to another is enough brachiating. Luckily, there is honey for left over from the day before. And we'll eat the wine aren't choosy foods. Peace is soon restored to the forest canopy. Asian black bears actually do at night. This is their secret. After a night with a lot of dancing, stretching, digging, stretching, time for a well-deserved nap. The tropical forest is characterized by high rainfall, a minimum of 200 centimeters annually. Of all biotic Around species 50 are indigenous to the rainforest. Where there is rain, there are waterfalls. The falls, there are rivers. Where there are water, where there are rivers, there is where life. Big Active. life. Ba Wild cattle quenching their thirst in the river. A crocodile pretends it's asleep, just waiting for the next bite. Sardia battering the young, blocking antlers. The rarely seen and endangered of a prey. tiger. Look. Elephants cooling down their body temperatures. Wild pigs teaching their offspring to cross a river. The Asian wild water, 1,000 kilograms, weighing up to a one ton, like a medium sized car. The predator, a challenge to In the darker Stricted undergrowth of the rainforest by poor penetration of sunlight, another kind of small life is found. Like these shrimps looking for mating grounds. A myriad of insects, ants, microorganisms, larvae, and beetles. Many still unnamed, undiscovered. Thousands. This is an alien world on the forest floor. Beautiful butterfly has its price. It's
It's a tidbit for the collared falconet. The head brutally it. it removes and throws the wings back into the air. Individuals are born, hunted, killed, and eat life in an everlasting cycle. Back and flies come in varied colors and shapes. Their bodies often blue, green. Their wings Puzzle. seem to shimmer as if made of transparent silver. Two eyes are made up Each of 20 to 25,000 tinier eyes, on the flying allowing them to zero out their daily meals. The position during mating, known as a wheel formation, is unique to insects. The female the may lay up to 100,000 near water. The eggs hatch after about two weeks. Dragonfly, a nymph, emerges. Once hatched, the nymph spends its time hunting and eating small fish family. or even members of its... Six months to seven years for a dragonfly. When it's ready to metamorphose into an adult, it climbs out of the water's final implant skin. Long before the dinosaurs walked the earth 300 million years ago, took to the air, dragonfly. And now, after years in the water, yet another beautiful dragonfly is born. And mate, it will feed, it will die. The archer fish. By squirting drops of water from its specialized mouth, the fish can knock down insects sitting on overhanging vegetation. They are able to hit their prey at distances of up to about two meters. Cast formation. A group of deep limestone caves. It's like a vampire's castle. Home to strange underworld formations. And rare, mysterious cave dwellers. Like bats, searching for evening prey. And the waterfall climbing cave fish. A sensation and still a mystery. This is the only place in the world it's blind one fish a glimpse with fins almost like feet that allow them to climb up ledges. They have no eyes and their bodies lack all pigmentation. It's like pink, translucent, and white, like ghosts. This is about as close as one can get to aliens on Earth. Another day in the forest canopy. Gibbons live in small, monogamous pairs and are composed of a mating. They mate for life, unlike most of the great apes. Since they are vulnerable to predators on the forest floor, they spend most of their lives in trees. They drink rainwater from tree holes, often by dipping a hand into the water. water. There is no breeding season. Gibbons may copulate any day, and the female will come into estrus at any time of the Gibbon families form tremendously strong and emotional bonds with each other. A poignant picture of motherhood. It's another dusky langur. Like gibbons, the langurs spend most of their time in trees. They fear water and will cross no body of it, river, lake, or swamp. Langa normally gives birth to a single skin. offspring, very rarely two, like this female, mother of two babies, a pair of twins waddling and jumping around, and a door of the When daylight starts to shimmer away, a giant shadow of doom from the underworld fills the sky. Of thousands upon thousands of bats emerge from the caves to feed on small insects.
When the night shift begins, different species take over. A night owl, various tree frogs. A civet, or as it is also called, a toddy cat. A snake, the peninsula pit viper. Tropical rainforests are home to many kinds of cub. The red breasted parakeets. The green magpie. Whiskered tree swift. Chinese pond heron. A white throated kingfisher. Blue magpie. Plain prinia. Superstar of Bung Porapet Lake. The pied kingfisher. This boldly patterned black and white plumaged bird may watch for prey from a perch. She's as many other kingfisher species. Then they dive into the water, creating a shower. Reappearing with its stabbed prey. More often, the pied may hover mid-air for up to a minute, taking its time to locate the perfect meal. Kingfisher is the largest bird capable of a true hover. When back on its perch, it tosses the fish into the air, catches it deftly, and makes sure to swallow it head first. Birds have four primary needs. Food, water, shelter, and a place to raise a family. Almost like human beings. Like humans, they also design and build complicated individual constructions. Homes for their intended and coming. The black and red broadbill collects material for a bulky, untidy ball nest hanging from the tip of a branch. The hornbill seeks out a suitable cavity in a tree and uses clay and mud to seal it from predators. The Asian open bill stalk builds a rough platform of sticks, often on half-submerged trees. Uses it to great yellow nate larger holes for its nests. Bayer weavers are known for their elaborately woven pendulous nests. These are created with a central nesting chamber. The highly complicated construction is made with long strips of paddy leaves and strips torn rough from grasses. palm fronds. The olive-backed sunbird builds a hanging flask-shaped nest with an overhanging port. The outside is often untidy and decorated with dead leaves and seed cases. Unlike the home of its cousin, the bayer weaver, golden weaver, the nest is an Asian structure. Once constructions are built and the chicks are hatched, mm -hmm. a frenzied feeding. Endless days and nights finding prey for apparent infinite open and thankless mouths. Eating the usual range of food, such as invertebrates, small animals, and fruit. The blue bearded bee eater, nesting in deep tunnels of mud, feeding their chicks, bees, and insects. It's not always easy to keep Small a nest that swarm from nowhere, causing itching and discomfort. The female blue-winged pitta calls for a helping hand. The male helps clean up by removing a sticky substance from the offspring's bottoms. This remote Buddhist temple is home to a group of the largest bats in the world, the flying fox. They camp in big trees. There are hundreds, sometimes even thousands. 
the day they hang out by during roosting in trees. Wings wrapped around their body. Squabbling noisily when hot and fanning them. Favoured roost sites are used for many years, and the trees become stripped of bark and foliage by the back of them carved branches that help. Flying foxes are social animals. Roosting together and hanging upside down because this is more energy efficient. During the day, they spend hours on personal rattling themselves and the gaining in It is likely that communal living comes at the cost of living among large numbers of external parasites. The temple camp is a base from which flying foxes make their day and nighttime foraging trips. When rain falls, they draw closer together in their camp, using their wings as umbrellas. A flying fox penetrating the sky like a vampire from a gothic novel. This is an underwater tropical forest, the Andaman Sea. Coral reefs, a true natural treasure. One quarter of the world's coral reefs lie in Southeast Asian waters. Forms a complete ecosystem. Each, the oldest and most productive ecosystems on Earth. Andaman Sea is home to the most diverse collection of marine life in the world. Like this spotless firefish. A black spotted toadfish. The painted flute mouth lives on the seafloor, close to plants or corals for protection and shelter. A jellyfish. One of the most venomous ocean might kill a human with stating mm -hmm. heads. But to the smallest fish in the sea, it forms a vibrating, protecting shield against outside predators. Another highly deadly species, the sea great. Bill Turtle. While being omnivorous, it feeds on algae, sea anemones, and different species fish. of sea sponges are the principal food. At times, the look. appearance of water species. Sometimes, just small. Often, extraordinary. Like this octopus. Eight arms, an octopus trail behind it as it swims. It has three hearts. Two for pumping blood to each of the gills, and a third for pumping blood through the entire body. For defense against predators, it uses color-changing camouflage. Within a second, it adjusts its colors. Green, red, brown or even a mixture of colors until the background is matched. The whale shark is a graceful, slow-moving giant and the biggest fish in the world. Confirmed individual, the largest of approximately 13 meters. 
with a weight of more than 22 tons. Its mouth is large enough to fit a human inside, but like a feeder, it is a harmless plankton and small fish. Above the sea, and not necessarily areas, far away, a variety from... of seabirds can be seen. The great egret. Wood sandpiper, winged stilts, black grey heron, and a large group of Brahmini kites looking for prey in the salty water. Kites are often scavengers, foraging both over water and land, feeding on dead fish and crabs. But occasionally they hunt live prats, such as hares. When fishing, they don't dive. Prey on the water surface is snatched with their talons. At the intersection of land and sea, mangrove forests support More a wealth of the health of the planet than, maybe. than we previously realized. Mangroves provide nursery grounds for a wide range of microbes, invertebrates, and crabs. An alien world of remarkable creatures fighting to survive. The mangrove swamp ecosystem feeds fish and shrimps, wading birds, and the long-tailed macaque, or crab-eating macaque. Although the macaque feeds on crabs, it is also known to eat almost 200 different types of plants and fruits, helping the forest to regenerate and keep its fragile balance. The macaque knows exactly where to look for prey. Sometimes, it even cleans off the mud before eating. The youngster seems to have invented its own fitness machine. Another youngster wants to join in. The inevitable fight that follows is quickly resolved by the alpha male. Long-tailed macaques are social animals. They live in groups of 15 to 30 individuals. The female gives birth to only one. Their social structure and behavior are almost as complex as humans. Each group, the troop, is made up of a dozen of female male. monkeys and their babies. Being strongly territorial, the gibbon body may defend its boundaries with vigorous visual and vocal displays. A male gibbon competitor has penetrated the alpha male. The alpha male, not only protecting his territory, but also his mate and newborn baby, frightens the intruder, chasing it away from his family's feeding ground. The female intruder has a chance of getting a piece of the cake. Returning from his chase, the alpha male immediately goes after the new intruder. Another predator is climbing the fruitful fig trees, a binturong. Cautiously, the female the gibbon tries to lure this Asian. It is too big a handful for her, so she leaves this job to her mate. The male gives them the species. bear cat. Finally, the gibbon male decides to retreat. Out of reach, only to cat. scare away yet another intruder. The great hornbill. Finally, 
after a busy day, time for some family reunion in the forest canopy. But for some, freedom is a luxury. Extinction is widespread tapestry, rapidly treating the life on Earth. 140,000 species per year are at risk. Once the biodiversity of our planet is lost, it can never be brought back again. As on our life is depleted by Asian hunting and trading. In this marketplace, exotic birds people have gathered to be captured in the rainforest, sold for the highest bid, and here participating in a bird singing competition. This is freedom. Wildlife still thrives in the wild. Colorful birds. Playful monkeys here. Mating deer. The strange underwater octopus. Butterflies. Gibbons. Jacana chicks. And the largest animal on Earth, the elephant. Species and many more have taken billions of years to form. Hopefully, we will let them stay a little longer in this fragile and remote world. The blue, white and green gem in the solar system. Our planet, our one and only home. A land of beauty and incredible contrasts. A forgotten Boons. and rarely seen. Rainy season and drought collide in an everlasting cycle. One of the most fertile places on the planet. 10% containing all animal species on Earth. Living in nature is always a struggle for existence. But these days, wildlife has to fight to survive in the face of habitat destruction and in the spread of human. Thailand is known for its dazzling mega city, Bangkok. Its exquisite cuisine, saffron-dressed monks, exotic beaches, and a world-famous nightlife. Thailand's warm climate and plentiful rainfall foster the growth of thick rainforests with abundant life. Animals are concentrated in the forested parts of the country, with 282 different mammal species and 925. This wealth makes Thailand a hotbed of biodiversity. Central Thailand is a natural, self-contained basin, often termed the rice bowl of Asia, by four rivers Carved and that flow south from the northern hills before merging into the sea. It is a flat, and fertile floodplain. The most conspicuous features of the country's terrain are the dramatic cliff-ridden mountains. They cover most of the northern country and extend along the Myanmar border on the west. In this hostile environment of rugged, rocky terrain, the cool temperature encourages the growth of flowers and fern. 